to Walmart, so I'm gonna show you guys what I got at Walmart, okay? So give me a minute. Okay, so first thing we got, see, we, we went to Wally World, not sponsored by Walmart, hopefully one day. So the first thing we got was, we got some ground turkey that I have to cook, guys. So we got ground, no, ground chicken, ground chicken, guys. Ground chicken is, see it says, ground chicken, chicken, chicken. Okay, hold on, guys. Let me actually move my footing so I can get better acquaintance. Okay, so we got some ground chicken, guys. Ground chicken. So I'm going to season this up. I'm going to make it delicious, okay? Get my coldest water bottle, guys. Co use my code water break, and you guys can get free shipping. And the bottles are like $21, so they're not bad. So we got ground chicken. Okay, so I got one one of these. I'm gonna season it up, guys, with some garlic pepper, lemon pepper, um, Mrs. Dash, all that salt, pepper, all that different stuff, sea salt. And I got two of these, guys. So these were like, I wanna say these were like $4 for each one. So I paid $8 for this, guys. So here's $8. Then I got... They changed the colors of Walmart bag. Remember, guys, when they were blue with the little, um, with the little smiley face, guys? I don't see if I can find a little clip. I don't know how to copy it and put it in. So, anyways, guys, the little smiley face, he would go and knock down the prices. So, I got Gatorade, guys. Gatorade Zero, guys, that I can drink. So, I got blue strawberry. This is strawberry. I got raspberry. Raspberry. And I got vanilla vanilla and guys i got oh here's my receipt dang it i forgot to give this evan here's your 20 i owe you so here's your 20 evan i forgot to give it to jama so we could put it in your card so we'll send it to you tomorrow evan sorry about that okay guys so here is hold on guys give me one minute i oh, know i'll do it at the end so here's my receipt guys that i spent at walmart so i spent I spent $30 at Walmart, guys. $30. Walmart is a lot cheaper. If I would have bought all of this at Publix, I'd have spent $80. Publix is expensive. So we got all these flavors of Gatorade, okay? So we got all this Gatorade. I call it Haterade for short. Okay. And then we did aloe vera drink. Aloe vera drink is so good, guys. We're going to try this on camera, okay, guys? I The person who actually introduced this to me was... Look at the tornado was my sister she told me about or my brother and my sister and i actually use it in this lotion is aloe vera and in this little tick tock is in this little tic tac is aloe vera lotion and that's why my skin looks so nice and shiny and not dry like if you guys go back and watch a lot of my old videos you can see right here i have like a lot of dry patches and on my face you can see it sometimes where it pops up here that's called Im I don't even know how to pronounce it, but I suffer from it. So I have to wear a lot of lotion, guys. And a lot of people suffer from it. They get bumps on their arms and different stuff and just dry patches. So I have that, guys. I'm still losing weight, guys, because you can see in my neck, you can start seeing my bones pop out. So it's like I'm still losing weight fast. I need to weigh myself. I haven't. So we're going to try this aloe vera. Okay. And this is just the plant. They have, they have mango, strawberry, and lemon. So we're going to try this, guys. Here we go. I haven't had this in a long time. Let's see if I can drink it. Oh, and I didn't see how much sugar is in it. There's supposed to be no sugar in it. It has zero everything, but it has vitamin A, vitamin B1, vitamin B6, and vitamin 12. And that's what I take. B12 I take. Okay, B12 I mean. Here we go. Bottom up, guys. Mmm, delicious. Delicious. And if you guys can see, it has little flakes in it that it helps clean your colon. Okay, so the next thing that we bought was, we bought two bags of, we bought, I bought two bags of Walmart quick and easy, quick and easy new, cauliflower rice new quick and easy cauliflower rice guys quick and easy so you literally pop this in your microwave for like oh god what does it say how many seconds how many seconds like 20 or 30 seconds guys this is for parents who are like fast on the go guys and they can't cook anything really quick so they have to cook something so they just pop this in in the pan 
Oh, 35 minutes in the microwave. 35 minutes in the microwave. And then you could serve it with like some chicken, some beef, pizza even. So I got two of these guys. So I'm going to actually freeze these and put these in the freezer because I made some meat yesterday that I should have blogged. And then I'm going to cook this, guys. And this is literally going to be my meals for a few days. So that will actually be with the ground chicken and cauliflower rice. So guys, write all this down so you guys can make some good meals. Um, Gio, tell your mom about it. Okay, so then the other thing that I got was I got two masks that were actually, these were $3.99. So I got one for my mom and one for my dad because I have the one that my sister made me. And you just put them on like this. Oh my God, I just put two on. So this is two masks for my mom and dad. But I, they don't like the little, they don't like these, the little flimsy ones. So I got them better ones. And then guys, I got this. So this is literally all my groceries. So I got this. Oh my God, this smells so delicious, guys. I sprayed it in the store and it smells so good. And the way that you use is that you turn it. So when you lock it, it closes the top to close. When you want to use it, it pops up and a lot of people use this and spray it and da, 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 da. And it's literally, I remember when this first came out, they had all those commercials for it, the tag commercials, the people in the nightclub all sweating, whatever. And then she would just, the guy would just go spray this and go back out and dance all night. And I remember I used, I wore this all the time when I was in high school. This and Bod were like my two favorite and Adidas. I'm not spending all that money for Gucci and Prada and all that stuff, no. If I ever become rich and famous, guys, that's what you will see in my closet. <laughs> so I'm getting in a drink, it's delicious. So guys, all together I spent, like I said, I'm a receipt. All I spent, oh, I showed you upside down, Walmart. All I spent was $30. I, that's, I mean, that's literally been the cheapest that I bought, like ever, guys. So. It's amazing that I spent that much and it's amazing that I was able to only just spend that much and didn't spend more. And then yesterday I ordered from Publix, so I ordered me some more raspberry Kool-Aid. So I have that. And then that's it. That's all I have. That's all I bought. That's all, folks. So anyways, guys, make sure to like and subscribe, guys. Go watch yesterday's video, guys. It was just a little talking video. Um, and we were going to do a live yesterday, but what happened was we couldn't do a live because drama had a family emergency, so we couldn't do the live. So it was okay, guys. I guess I still technically could do one by myself and just have you guys come in. And let me know if you guys want me to do a Zoom call. I was thinking about doing a Zoom call because I think you're allowed like 100 people. So what I would do is make an account, like a Reese Boy account. You guys would have to get your parents' permission first. They could sit there. They can, they can come on with you, whatever it is, whatever they're comfortable with. And we just... Basically, I'm in the middle, almost like you guys are doing your classes right now because a lot of kids are doing this online on Zoom classes. And basically what you guys do is you guys would ask me whatever questions you've wanted to ask me that I have never answered in a video basically before. And you guys would just, we collect plastic bags here. So I got to put all these in a bag because then they come in handy when you want to take something to a friend's house or, you know, want to give a person a bag if they're coming over to spend the night and they want to take something home. So basically, guys, what it would be is, what it would be is you guys would ask me questions and then I would respond to the questions and I would answer them and we would probably do, I know it's only free for one hour, so maybe we do like one hour like every Friday or something. So let me know if you guys like that idea because I would do that, that would be fun. And then I was thinking about doing a house party type of thing like for like i don't know maybe for like halloween do like a big house party with like all my fans i think that would be really fun and have all you guys like come in there and get your parents permission again i don't know i just want to give back to like my fans that have been here from day one especially a lot of them who were there but they weren't allowed to have social media but they were still watching me that to me is just like amazing that they've been here from day one and still supporting me even though they weren't really allowed to have youtube but they were still there supporting me it looks like i have a bump but it's not it's a hair I don't like it. I feel like I have like a pimple coming. Maybe I do. Maybe it is a pimple. I don't know. But um Guys, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Let me know about this, guys. I don't know if I want to retire from TikTok. I don't know yet because I feel like I got to a point where I'm happy at. I'm happy at 4.3 million and I'm happy at 3,000 followers and whatever and i don't see myself getting bigger because i don't follow the trends 
So I don't think I will ever have a million followers. I really don't think I'll ever have that. So you need to not be so like, I'm not gonna dream big anymore. Like guys, I stayed up all night, literally just talking between me and God. And I was like, you know what? If my type of career is that I'm not as big as some YouTubers, I'm okay with that, you know? Like, if I grow in different ways and I do different stuff to help me, like, do my dreams that I want to do, then I'm good with that. But I'm not going to stress about it anymore. Like, I grew TikTok to where it is. I never thought TikTok would be where it is. Um... I don't know. I don't know. That's something that I got to decide on because it is what made me have this other platform. So it is what helped me get big. So I just, I don't know what I'm going to do yet with that. But comment below if you guys think I should retire from TikTok or keep going and give it like another three years because I've had it since 2017 or 18. I think 18 is when I started. Yeah, 18, 18. So I don't know if it's time for me to retire from TikTok. I want to use another platform. I want to use something like I want to do little skits and stuff. And I know you can do little skits on TikTok and I know you can do little skits on Facebook, but I'm like, I don't know. I just want to do something else. I don't know. I'm kind of tired with it because it's like the numbers are like falling. Like they're not like I know I have more people liking stuff, but I'm not seeing it. So it's like it's still messed up because it's still in limbo with knowing what's going to happen with the app. Is it getting deleted? Is it staying? What's happening? Microsoft was going to buy it. Now they're not. Apple was. It's just like so many different people were going to buy it. Because this is what happened with Vine. Vine was not the same situation. I don't know what really happened with Vine. Supposedly it went bankrupt, but I don't know what happened. But then TikTok came along and just wiped it out. Same with like Kik Kik, same with like you, what it was the other one? You year, you something, that one was all big that made a lot of these big YouTube, these TikTokers and YouTubers popular, disappeared. It's still there. It's just not a lot of people use it anymore. Um, so yeah, guys, I don't know. I don't know if I should delete it or if I should keep it, guys. Comment below if you guys want to keep it. If you guys only follow me on TikTok and you don't follow me on YouTube. If I delete it, I hope everyone from TikTok all of you guys, all 3,000 of you guys will come to my YouTube channel if I finally do decide to delete it and just take a break or just disactuate it or whatever it is or just leave it where it is and just don't come back to it. Because I did take a break for a month to focus on my YouTube and it worked. I got monetized. So I don't know what I'm going to do with that platform. I just know as I get bigger and as I start moving and moving and moving and moving in the career of YouTube, then I probably will slow down on TikTok. But if I do both, then you guys will be happy with that. So I don't know. Comment below if it's time for me to delete it or if you want me to keep going with it. Or if that's where you guys found me and you're like, no, don't delete it. Keep going because that's how I found you. Then I'm going to keep going because that's what will make you guys happy. So let me know what you guys want me to do. Comment below if I should keep it or not keep it. And go to Walmart, guys. I'm kind of... Guys, do... Okay, so I have this trend, guys, or this challenge. Go try to do some cauliflower and some ground chicken. Cook it. Send me a picture on Instagram, on Reese and Jama on Instagram. And tell me what your family thinks. Try to make it for them. So all you need is just to buy this. It's like four... It's one dollar. One dollar at Walmart. Buy this. Put this in the microwave. Like I said, 35 minutes. And then or seconds, whatever it is, and then serve it with some ground chicken, guys, or whatever you want. If you want beef or ground chicken, guys, serve it with ground chicken or beef and add seasoning and then take a picture of it and send it to me, okay, guys? Whatever you, whatever social media you follow me on or make a YouTube video of it and say, this is for Reesey Boy. Um, and then let me know what you guys think about it and, and surprise your parents. Make it for dinner, make it for lunch, make it for something. Um, and again, guys, I'm still looking for that... Uh, designer to design some merch for me because i was like you know what a lot of youtubers and i'm not copying them but it makes sense to have their fans make their merch and then they put it on their youtube channel and on all their social media so whoever wants to design some merch send it to the p.o box and then we will definitely give you a shout out and put it on youtube and um let you guys know all right peace guys and i'll see y'all later